Hello, Miss Maisie, how are we doing this morning? Good morning, everybody. Welcome to a Sunday reset. Filling my little supplements. I've been getting so bad at doing it. to bake a red velvet cake ever since we moved in. I'm not gonna make it completely from scratch. I am not that impressive. The main thing that I was taught is it doesn't matter if you make the cake from a box. It doesn't have to be made from scratch. It's the, the frosting that you have to absolutely make from scratch that makes it taste homemade. I'm going to this new grocery store that's a little bit closer to my house. This morning, I look insane. I'm going to be listening to the audiobook that I told you guys about a couple vlogs ago. It's The Courage to Be Disliked. It's linked in the description below if you guys aren't interested. It's been really good to just listen to. I find myself honestly putting it on instead of music when I'm in the car, which is like weird for me. It's in the description below as well as other podcasts I've listened to that are top notch, so. This is the shortest grocery list I've ever made. This is what we got, so let's go get our groceries. I just got done grocery shopping. I've been on the phone with me Madre the entire time. And she's so jealous of me because I got Smoothie King. I've been waiting for Brayden because I don't think he's ever had it before, so I wanted it to be this cute thing. But I've passed it so many times already. It's right next to my house. Yeah, strawberry Kiwi Smoothie. This is our first taste test. We have not had it in years. Oh, oh my God, that's fresh. That's definitely a 10 out of 10 smoothie, I'd say. Not gonna lie, I've been sitting on my phone for a bit. I am so tired today. I'm so exhausted. But it is time now to bake the cake. I also got some sprinkles.
taking a quick oh i hit my toe we're taking a quick break from baking i'm freezing it's 70 degrees in here and i swear it still feels like at least 50 degrees i feel like a mother mother if you see me folding underwear just don't be weird about it i did pull my cake out of the oven it needs to obviously cool down before i can put the frosting on which i have not made yet because my butter and cream cheese still needs to soften so i forgot about that i feel like this is honestly the first sunday i've had in quite a while i'm taking these are i, I hate these this is like the first sunday where it actually feels like somewhat of a re Set. Today has been pretty good so far though. It's been nice to bake. I like baking, I do, and I never expressed that enough. Even though I took my B12 today and my B1, I'm tired still. I think ugh, jumping into the deepness of it all. I literally have just been so stressed. I've been so stressed all the time. Stress, stress, stress about literally everything under the sun if you ask Brayden he'll be like yes of course she's gonna stress about that because what does she not stress about it's been taking a toll on my body so when my brain spins on like doom and gloom or worst case scenario because it literally feels like my brain is spinning in a circle and won't hop off but yeah i think that's why i'm especially exhausted today because i've allowed myself to spin so much and i just I, I just don't have the energy today i really i don't have the need to want to you know what shit will work itself out there's so much i could sit here and talk about that i'm stressed about just regarding the future my career all this stuff but we're gonna start working on the mindset of bitch it's just gonna work out one way or the other like and i don't need to compare i don't need to contrast and i don't need to be worried i think i'm gonna actually check on the butter and the cream cheese once i put all these clothes away and it's not gonna be softened but i'm gonna put it in the microwave <laughs> we just made the frosting i should probably wash my hands i've just been licking the frosting <laughs> i just realized the cake has been able to cool off for the past couple hours, so it should be fine. I've been watching the Dallas Cowgirl Cheerleader documentary on Netflix. Nope. Okay, we're really good in there. Oh! <gasps> that was a little too perfect. This cake about to explode. <laughs> and we're just gonna lather it on. I'm nervous. Ooh, that is... A very nice feeling. The sides are always the hardest part though. This is the first cake I've ever baked in this apartment. That's so exciting. I mean, now it's time for the sprinkles. I don't know what I'm gonna do with the rest of my fucking frosting. This is so exciting. I have to take a picture of it. I just got out of the bath. Oh, overexposed. Okay, it's fine. I just got out of the bath wearing the same pajamas you guys saw in the last video because I've been on my vlogging game. Okay, that's how close these videos were filmed, all right? I uploaded yesterday, editing today, hopefully uploading tomorrow. I have nothing going on for the rest of the day. I just wanted to do a little outro for this video. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I hope you guys are liking the consistency of the content. And it was honestly really fun to film such a chill Sunday where I got to go out, do a couple of things, but then come back home and just bake. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you with a new vlog very soon. Bye!